Hey y'all, just thought I'd do an update with y'all on my greenhouse and what I have going on here. Um, here got my little ghost plant. It's doing good. And I just love it. And I got this one from um, the Cacti Farmer on Instagram. I ain't gonna go through all the names because I just came to show y'all the update on the greenhouse, what I have going on. Actually, I just got this from Emily from the Suckling Greenhouse. I got this from her the other day. And also, I'll show you the other one I have from her. So, yeah. Those are not really doing too well. I don't know what to, um, how to really take care of these, but they're not really doing too well. They look completely different than when I had them. Got them. First got them. And it's backwards. Let me turn it around. And then look, I have that, the Cedum Trelisi. This one, it had stretched out when it was inside the house. I brought it outside, um, and I was growing the perfect rosette now, and I had took a couple of leaves off, as you can see. I was going to behead it, but I had to let the rosette grow in first around because the whole thing was open, like, like the bottom leaves. The whole thing was like that, but I just let it grow back in before I beheaded it and replanted it. And look at my whole Warthia. It has about like two babies on there, you see? Right there, right there. And it got so big. And look at the plant. The plant is getting so full and big and healthy. It didn't have these many leaves before. And that's what I got for free. I forgot for a site I bought it off. I believe it was leaf and clay, I believe. That's what I got for free too. It's not doing so well either. I rescued it from um Home Depot. This one, um, it was a cutting. It's trying to root. I can't remember where I got this topsy turvy from. But it's just leaning. I be trying to it's just rooted like that now. So, I got it there. And then I got up here. My Alpenglows, which grew a bunch because they were so short when I put them in the pot. And look how high they grew up. They wasn't, they was low inside the pot when I first planted them. And look how high they grew up. Then I got my rat tail um, cactus that I just purchased. And I got the Montreal sock got the name of it then up here is my little collection up here this one is not doing so as you can see the side of it is going i don't know what's wrong with it somebody help me let me know and then look i was devastated right because this one fell it was together with this one it was together a nice big round cluster and pretty but look at all the babies that grew after it fell. Remember when my greenhouse fell over when we had the big windstorm and it damaged it? I have one, two, three, four. Yeah, one, two, three, four. Yeah. And then I also have five and six. Yeah, so I ain't complaining. You know? So, and then look up here. My little thing I put together is growing very nicely. This one got damaged as well. When we had the little snowstorm, let me move back for y'all. When we had the little snowstorm, yeah. And I got this one also from Emily from the Suckling Greenhouse. at this one my little prickly pear it is growing a lot a lot it was so small when i first got them i believe in march my 
husband got me these two as well. And this was also what I had got from Emily from the Suckling Greenhouse. And she gave me these um, string, of, string of hearts for free. So remember, I got this from her. And also this the other day. And she gave me the string of hearts as a free gift. Thank you so much. I appreciate it. <clears throat> Here are my Debbies, which is recovering a lot. They had um, Millie Bugs when I first got them. And you can see the leaves are damaged, but I cleaned them with alcohol. I cleaned it with alcohol, and as you can see, they're growing in very nicely now. I'm trying not to touch the ones that's growing in nice. Yeah, so they're doing good now. I maybe need to put them over here so they can get some more sun, probably. And then look at my babies. This one actually is the one I beheaded. I beheaded this one, and those two heads grew at the top right here those two babies and then also this one grew from the side so yeah I'm happy with that and then as you can see I have babies all in there right there coming around and then one growing also on the back of it right there it's not focusing but you can see it right there Yep. So then I have the J plant, the trail and J plant that I also got from the cacti farmer. She gave me those for free with the string of bananas. I always got this one from um, Walmart the other day trying to rescue it. <laughs> trying to see how I could do. It has three heads on it. My domino cactus starting a little sprouts up there has three. Yeah, so can't wait. And then down there. Oh my god, look how much it's growing. I beheaded this also. Okay, this one was a leaf. This is what I started from propagation right here. This one. So this is a leaf from propagation I started, and it's coming along very nicely. But I beheaded this one right here. Right here, I beheaded it, and it grew these. This one, this one, and this one. It grew three heads on it. And I'm thinking maybe I should move that also because it's looking like it's starting to stretch out. But I don't see how because this whole greenhouse gets full sun. And I just had to pull one out right here. One rotted out. I don't know how. But I left some good leaves in there. Maybe it'll come about. So yeah. This is what I have going on right now. And I also has more, have more out in the front of my window. My front window. So I'll take you out there to see that. Right now. Moody, say hi. Say hi, Moody. That's my baby, Moody, everybody. Say hi, somebody. Hi. Hi, baby. You ready to go inside? Huh? Yeah, you ready? Okay. Let's go show them the rest of the plants. Okay, I have these inside the house because I really honestly don't know what to do with them. They are dying. It had two big ones like these leaves. It had two on the sides of here. They are completely gone now. I have no idea. I have not watered them or anything. So, I mean, if anybody's watching this, and um, same for here. See, it's the piece right there. But if anybody's watching this and want them, because I can't take care of them. I don't know what's going on with them. And they're free. Just pay for your shipping, and I'll just give them to you. But let me go show you what I have outside in the front. Okay, y'all. This is what I have outside my window. These are also leaves that I started from propagation. These, these right here. And then I got these from um, the Walmart um, run I did. I mean, the Home Depot run I did the other day. I also purchased this. And then look at this. Um, I got this one. This pink butterfly from Emily. Um, I forget where I got these from. But yeah. 
And I also got this one from Home Depot that I rescued. I'm trying to see what's going on with this. And then look, I have my Super Bum and another one and then another one. That's the one that I be headed outside that it grew three heads and three babies right there. So yeah. Then inside, I have my propagations. Let me turn the light off. Okay, so this is what I have. <laughs> this one, one of two of them died for no reason. I did not water them at all. This one and that one. My light stops. They just died. I don't know why. See, they just disappeared. That one and that one. And then this is everything that I started from leaves, everybody. Look, of my propagations. Oh, I purchased this also for $5, you guys. $5 at um, Home Depot. I love that aloe plant, um, aloe plant. But everything else is my propagation from leaves. Look, how they are coming together so nice. I'm so excited. That's my experiment pot right there. But yeah, all of these are from leaves. These are from the arm um, leaves, also from the, the plant that I beheaded. Growing nicely and big and healthy. And I just have them in the um, egg carton containers. That's it. And that's how I've been doing them. And they've been coming along nicely. I hope this one survives. Where is it? Because it's a double. Look at them heads on that one. I tried to cover it with dirt because it looked like it had no roots. So I'm just trying to save it. But yeah, look at the string of, um, I believe the string of, I forgot. But yeah, those, they're coming along. So yeah, y'all. And look at this one. Also with all the heads on it. Well, yeah, that's all I have to show y'all for now. So, I just wanted to keep y'all updated on myself. I know I was going for a long time. So, I'm just trying to come back. Look at that owl plant. I love it. And it has three heads on it. Four. I love it. Well, see you guys later. See you guys next time. Maybe I'm going to do my Lowe's run for one of my subscribers requested. Have a good day.